Now, a massive blaze has engulfed a seven-story building in central Sydney and more than 100 firefighters are battling the towering flames. And thick smoke from the multi-story building, according to the emergency services, more than 20 trucks have been deployed to contain and also extinguish the blaze. Officials say that at least one nearby vehicle has been destroyed by the fire. And the fire services have urged the public to avoid the area completely as firefighting operations continue. Light rail services near the blaze have also been suspended until further notice. A spokesperson for the New South Wales Police said that there were currently no reports of injuries. Now for more on this, our principal diplomatic correspondent Sudan Sibul is currently in Sydney covering this development. Take a look. Well, I'm standing at the location where the fire broke uh, earlier today in Sydney and of course we know that uh, uh, there's a building uh, that was ablaze uh, right now behind me. You can see a number of fire attendants present uh, and uh, trying to douse the fire. This is located at a busy area in Sydney and authorities are leaving no stone unturned to make sure that the fire can be doused. Uh, you can see behind me uh, when it comes to authorities present in full uh, force to make sure that uh, uh, the area is not disrupted but largely the large part of this area has now been closed with video journalist Sanjeet Sadhansipal for Vion in Sydney, Australia.